So if if the uh, penguins they need the krill to feed their young, mm. and then the orca feed on the penguin, so it's a cycle of life. Wow! Like lion. That was great. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's great. Right. So yeah. global warming. Hey guys! Hi! It's Meg and Ian again. That should have been Ian and Meg. But... I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this will be our fourth mukbang. Today is hot pot. Yes, as you can see. Do you want to tell them what we so tell them what we've already put into it? Uh, so we've put in fish tofu, shrimp meatball. What is this thing again? Something fish, right? Oh, those are the fish. Shumai. Fish shumai. Yeah. Um, and pork, uh, pork, pork balls. balls. They don't like those Which pork one? balls. Pork right? ball. This one here. I don't like them. You like them. No. You like everything. I like any. Yeah, yeah. Why does this seem so loud? Like, no. Fish toe boots. <laughs> <laughs> We're in an airport. A helicopter. Okay, there we go. Okay. <laughs> And then we bought these shrimp balls at the Chinese grocery store last minute. So we'll see how those are. Yeah. Awesome. This is like our second time doing hot pot this week. And then a few other things that we have. We have the uh, yeah. pork. Is this pork belly? This uh, one? Yes. Yeah. The pork yes. belly. We got it from TNT. Uh, and then this monstrous. <laughs> Beef. Is it iron flat? I can't remember Be what it's called. Beef flat iron steak? Flat iron yeah. steak. We got this from this place called Glory Meats. It's our first time there. Yes. Yeah. Korean. The Korean market. Ian passed. He's lived here. How long have you lived here for? Uh, almost three years. Yeah, three years. No, three you... years. It's April. Really? It's three years. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> yeah. Happy anniversary. And he's never been into that um, <laughs> grocery store, but I knew the way that it looked. I was like, they have to have cheap meat in there, and I was right. All of that costs less than nineteen dollars. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, at TNT, they have like way less for like sixteen dollars. Eighteen bucks for maybe like I swear it was like a third. Yeah. A third of the size mm -hmm. uh, for vegetables. So, so. that way, well, that's a savings goal. Find a Korean meat store. Yeah. To buy all your meat. Because I'm gonna freeze that. We're gonna freeze that yeah. tonight. Right? Yeah, the rest of it. Yeah. So the not so uh, exciting stuff, like so. Excuse there's... you. Oh, sorry. It, exciting. It matches your shirt. Yes. Veggie. You're a big veggie. What else do we have? More veg. Show the veg. Oh yeah. I don't know why. <laughs> spinach. Is it spinach? What is it? There's spinach. I think there's spinach in there. Hmm. And then there's yu choy. Yu choy. Oh, it might just be yu choy. Yeah. They all look the same to me. Oh, I'm putting the wrong front of the wrong one. <laughs> okay. Oh. And enoki mushroom. Your favorite. Yay, they're like noodles. Oh, yeah, we've got some dumplings. Enoki mushroom. Some dumplings. Those are from Fisherman's Wharf. Well, they're from TNT, but Fisherman's Wharf brand. So we have pork and chive, and then pork and cabbage. So good. And we also have some glass noodles. I've secretly been drinking this. This is my, this flavor is my favorite. Really? You took it. Well, you can have one too. So Someone said you can't. I have lychee. Oh yeah, what do show. we have? Okay. I have lychee. I have chrysanthemum. Can you see it? Move. Why is my, okay. Hold You're on. the wrong way. Oh, sorry. Yo, yo can cook. You can cook. Yeah, that's. Chrysanthemum. Oh, and I have my beer. 
should see what the foam looks like before. It's beautiful. So this is uh, it's a local beer. Salt Spring Island Earl Grey. Tastes really good. So very, very good. It tastes like tea? How many percent? Uh, seven. seven percent! Yeah. You're gonna be wasted. Mm -hmm. Okay, should we eat? Mm -hmm. Which one do you wanna eat? Let's try these things first. Oh, the sauces. Oh, yeah. Um, May, can you explain what you put on here? I put garlic, minced garlic, green onion, um, satay sauce, this chili oil sauce, your mom's fresh homemade ghost pepper sauce. So Crazy sauce. Soy sauce, lemon, and a tiny bit of vinegar. Yeah. Cool. Mm -hmm. All right. Everyone knows the sauce is the best part, I think, right? Always. Okay. Let's dig in. <laughs> Cause I'm so hungry. Right. Um, let's grab some of these. It's been. Oh, I want to try the shrimp bowl. Yeah. Use this one's a lot easier. These are like my one of my favorite things. The fishy one. I'm trying this. All in the bowl. I'm gonna end up eating all the pork balls. Just okay. No, yeah, I don't want them. You can give me more of these if you want. Which one? I this? Like these ones better. Yeah, you can have that one then. Not all of them, I'm just saying if you want. She put some. What? What do you want? Because the, the dumplings will take a while too. Yes, we'll okay. do the dumplings. Now? You want some of that first? The meat? Yeah. The beef? Let's Probably. eat one of this first. Yeah, Which one you need? A lot of stuff happening. Yeah. Let's try the shrimp bowl. Yes. Dip it in. Is it good? I should have tried it without the sauce. Really? Yeah. Not even what do it. you think? Yeah, I like it. Yeah? It's not mm -hmm. good. It's like really soft. Can't taste like shrimp per se. Kind of just tastes like seafood imitation, I don't know, flavoring. No? Almost chose the um, the taste like lobster one. How the heck do they make those things? I think they probably have lobsters powder. How? <laughs> so it's just made up with like spices? I don't know. Mm. I don't have the answers you're looking for. Mm. What's that? The fish tofu. Mm. It's good today. Mm -hmm. mm. My favorite! Ah, beer. It's kind of blurry, eh? I don't know. It's only focusing on me. Oh, really? <laughs> it doesn't even focus on the food. How come? It's a GoPro. GoPro just focus and oh no not for you oh <laughs> I said because you said it was focusing on you, <laughs> you know, I like beat him no <laughs> is this you know me <laughs> mm. mm. yeah what let me I like that pork bowl beef spices. Please. Oh, we need chopsticks. It's too late. You touched it. No, 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 no. These are the rules of the hot pot. We need a burn off. You <laughs> burn off the bacteria. Am I gonna get mad cow disease? 
Maybe. <laughs> I don't think that's how you get mad cow disease. It's on cooked meat. Is it? Yeah. Here, pass I me I don't your... think that's how you get mad cow disease. Pass me your thing. What thing? Uh, okay. your ladle. I don't think you get mad cow disease. Oh my god, it's a fatal disease. You know what it does? What? Do you know? I've seen it. Like, yeah, you die. You, there's no cure for it. But do you know what it does? Um... Does mm. it make you go crazy or what? Sorry, people cannot get mad cow disease. What? <laughs> Just a string of raw meat. So, they... mad cow disease is a fatal disease that slowly destroys the brain and spinal cord, which is the central, which make up the central nervous system in cattle. It is also known as what are you doing? For you. Put it in the soup. Oh. It is also known as bovine spongiform encephalopathy. People cannot get mad cow disease. No, I can hold it. No, no, I, I oh, you, you do yours. You do yours. So people can't... What? So what? why are we cooking... Why do we have to cook this meat so proper? Is it like E. coli? Wait, hold on. People cannot get mad cow disease. However, in rare cases, they can get a human form of mad cow disease called variant... Oh my god. Kreutzfeldt... I don't know. I don't even know. C-R-E-U-T-Z-F-E-L-D-T. Jacob disease. Which is also fatal. This can happen if you eat nerve tissue, the brain and spinal cord of cattle that were infected with mad cow disease. So if brain and spinal cord were in here, then we could get it, but. So I swear I thought this whole time that, you know, we learned something new. So I hope you guys <laughs> learned something new from this uh, mukbang. <laughs> Is uh, we can't get mad cow disease, so go all out, you know, just eat the rare, all the rare meat. No, I'm kidding. Disclaimer notice. Don't yeah. Disclaimer <laughs> don't do, notice. Do not. Don't do anything Ian says. <laughs> <laughs> oh look at this when it's cooked, so meaty. Is it focus? <laughs> what? Here. How do you? Is it doing it? Is it doing anything? <laughs> Good attempt. Thank you. <sighs> no, no, no. Is it good? Mm-hmm. You go mm -hmm. back there for barbecue, eh? Mm. Eighteen dollars well spent. Mmm, this is good. <laughs> what are you doing? It's hot. Okay. Whew, that was a lot of effort. Okay. Ready? Nothing thick, eh? Meaty. Mm-hmm. Wow, oh, that's yummy. Yeah, I really like it. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Imagine just this and like like sweet soy sauce or something. Do you have any? No. Get some more stuff down and put the dumplings in. Okay? Okay. So I don't know, for whatever reason, like this is, so this is our second time of Hot Pot this week. I don't know why I've been feeling like hot pot so much lately. Is it because it's raining out, rainy outside? Well, it's sunny this afternoon. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Do you like hot pot now? I do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I've never <clears throat> to let you guys know. Like the first time I tried hot pot was back in uh, 
was only like two or three years ago. So I did not know the method. Did you put the danger fork on your napkin? It's not the danger, it's the mad cow fork. Oh my god. What's, now you need a new napkin. Put it like this. That's how you get mad cow disease, or the human variant. <laughs> no, this stuff is from Glory Meats. I mean, Glory Meat stuff is good. <laughs> how do you know that? It's Glory, I mean. Just put them all in or mix them all in? Beer! Here. No. So good. You're getting full really fast. Okay. I'm just gonna drink this bottle of soju by myself. You want some? Sure. I'll share some soju. I'm drink first. We're not even gonna try this. The lychee. <laughs> it's apple flavor. Area 51s. <laughs> You're not supposed to be drinking this stuff. <sighs> Great. Fantastic. So what else is new? What's new? <clears throat> so we watch uh, Open Planet. Our <clears throat> planet. You don't even know what the show is called. Was it it's our, our planet? planet? Oh, there was. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know. <laughs> I mean, it's a, no, was it one planet? I'm pretty sure it's our planet. Okay, so it's one planet, our planet, or open planet. So I, I think. David Attenborough. Yes, that yeah, one. Yeah, everyone knows what that show is. Oh. Everyone knows. Seems to be the hype. I mean. I, what, what do you think of it? I, you saw it. Yeah. I was half asleep. I think the moral of the story here is that everything is connected. So. I thought the moral was to protect our planet. Yeah. So everything is connected. For example, those krills in the Antarctic, they feed on the, the plankton underneath the ice. Right. Then what? It, it doesn't, it, they don't come up if, without the ice being there. So they're like. The plankton a, don't come up? Yeah, the krills. The krills. And what are krills? It's like those shrimp okay. but there's a different kind of shrimp it's like uh um uh, down in the deep sort of shrimp it's like the see-through shrimp I, I don't think it likes the sun so imagine so and then the penguins eat the krills the uh the whales eat the krills um and then so without the krills i mean the, the whale will won't have any food the humpback whales mm. right um, same thing. So if, if the uh, penguins, they need the krill to feed their young mm. and then the orca feed on the penguin. So it's a cycle of life. Wow. Like lion That was great. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's great. Right? So yeah. global warming is, you know, we can't take the world for granted anymore. No. Yeah. Right? So. Right. I don't know. Yeah. You should just narrate the show. Yeah, I think so. I can just summarize <laughs> yeah, it for yeah. everyone. So just an FYI, everything is connected. We need to put another cup of cold water on here. Oh, we do? Right? Do you think they were cooked? I'm afraid to eat them. So here's the danger with hot pot. Um, you never know if you'll wake up the next morning. Pork belly. I'm sure the dumpling is done. There's no way it's taking that long. That thing should be like, you know. How would you know? I'm gonna try this drink. Okay. 
I'm gonna double mute this. Danger napkins. Mmm, this is nice. It's not too sweet. Mmm, mm, yeah. Super refreshing. It's not better than mine. No, mine's better than yours. That's not. You just don't. You don't even want it. Can you have a dumpling, please? Tell me if it's cooked. Take one for the team. <laughs> <sighs> Has to be. I mean, this one. Is it cooked? Oh, heck yeah. It's so hot. <laughs> Look, done. Okay, fine. I'm gonna have... This one's gotta be the one with the chive. I like chives. Chives. Um, In one month, we've done nothing new. We've been to Seattle. Oh, yes. How did we like Seattle? That was Ian's first time to Seattle. You know, every time I pass by Seattle, it's always cloudy, gloomy, and I've, you know, never felt like, you know, it, it, it's not uh, inviting for me to go there. You don't need to stop in. Yeah, exactly. And uh, Where are you going on your way? I uh, went to, to Portland. I've been to Portland, went by, and I was just like, Seattle, uh, it's cloudy, I don't feel like it, but, like, it... I love this trip. I actually love Seattle. Like, when we went there, it was, like, nice and sunny. Um, all the food was great. We went to this place called Local 360. Um, you know, the we bartender. We made friends there. We made friends. Like, the bartender was amazing. And, um, uh, in two fact, bartenders. Two both bartenders. And a third one. She just got the job there. Oh, yeah. There was this lady who was sitting beside us. We were talking to her. Next thing you know, I'm pretty sure that she works there now. So we know <laughs> three people from that place. It was a bucket shock. Yes. I never eat oysters because I'm afraid of getting norovirus or I haven't eaten them in like three years but then I watched we watched Anthony Bourdain so when you're in Seattle you have to eat oysters so then we had oysters and I didn't die or I didn't get sick so I might have them again mm -hmm. and in fact one of the bartender came by to uh, visit us in um, in Vancouver oh yeah that's um, right and uh, yeah we had a great time we had a blast so mm -hmm. yeah What are your thoughts about Seattle? About that trip? Um, I really liked it. It was just, you know, when you work full time and then all you want is some time off, and then just, and when you go to a new city, you're just like, I can do anything I want for two, three days? It was three days? Two or three days, whatever. Mm -hmm. I forget. You can drink starting at 9 a.m. if you wanted. Yeah. I just, I mean, I've been to Seattle before, so like, I kind of, I was just there to eat good food and drink delicious drinks. Make new friends. Yes. Yes. Uh, what, I went to, oh, we went. That we was went. our first trip alone, actually, together. Yeah. Yeah, every trip we've been on has been, other people have been there, which is great, too. I love, I love all of our friends. But this was, like, our own first trip. So I love Pike Place Chowder. Mm. Love it. Um, like we had the fresh crab sandwich. We had the lobster san fresh lobster sandwich. The uh, you know the New England chowder. It was great. <laughs> but <laughs> I did not know it was gonna be that expensive. You know, like <laughs> so when they said it was like, I think you know. So she's. <laughs> I love the so we ordered four things: the two chowders, um, and the two sandwich. And one, she, one, no, half, half a lobster, half a crab sandwich. 
Yeah. And I thought it was, I thought she said 50 bucks. So I <laughs> gave like, her. Yeah, America, the land of the green. Yeah. So, so cheap. I, cash, I gave her $20 cash and she just like stood there waiting. Huh? And. <laughs> How embarrassing. And I was just like, <laughs> okay, like you're not going to take my money? Like, yeah. Here's 20 bucks cash. And it was 50 bucks. <laughs> more, I, swear, I think it was, it was like, more than 50, wasn't it? Was like it was 58 bucks. Something. I was just like, okay. Because I thought this is like <laughs> lunchtime. We're just going to have a small lunch. But. No, by all means, it was just because well, there's a lineup amazing. too, so we yeah. felt like we had to order the stuff that, like, all of the things that we wanted. Yeah, because it's very expensive. Yeah, I mean, we watch videos beforehand. We watch uh, Mikey Chan. We watch. <laughs> what is uh, it? Strictly dumpling. Strictly dumpling. Strictly dumpling. We watch uh, uh, Anthony Bourdain, of course. We love, you know, uh, R.I.P. Uh, Anthony Bourdain, love the guy. Um, so that's why we had to do those things. And he never yeah. went to Pike Place Chowder. He didn't. No. No. Oh. That's way too pedestrian for Anthony Bourdain. I'm gonna cook this for you. Mmm, romance. <laughs> See, it's probably easier if I do this. Thank you. Yeah. So romantic. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Story of my life. Poor guy. So guys, we're gonna be. I think we're gonna be starting up a website soon. Yeah. So. If you set it up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then we will. Cause I know you've used to blog before. I used right? to blog about food, yeah, but then I just stopped. But I also don't know how to do a lot of the blog things, but you know how to do that stuff. So yeah. you're, he's... I'm the IT. Yes. <laughs> Let's call his help desk. He's help desk. Yeah. I'm, I'm the brains. Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm the beauty and the brains. Yeah. Just kidding. You you're at... beautiful. <laughs> you're welcome. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, it's not cooked. Not cooked? It's pink. It's both pink. Okay, pull pull the other one. Pull no no no, no this no, one. This no, one. they're both pink. Just put it back out. Just I'll put it back in. Okay. All of it. I don't want to die. <laughs> Do you think I need a new bowl? No. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to get sick. <laughs> Tomorrow I have to go to a, a wedding shower, a bridal shower for my cousin. I don't know. What do you th Oh, you know who's been to a bridal shower before? This guy! <laughs> Tell him about the time you went to a bridal shower. You've been to more bridal showers than I have. I try to avoid these things if I can because I just, oh, there's such a money grab. You always have to pay so much money to yeah. go to someone else's wedding and like, why do you get so many gifts and money because you found love? That seems really unfair. There was a... And I also just bought her. For her wedding, we, she sent the registry. It's basically, you just get married. And what did you made a joke? You said, "Oh well, why why should we buy things from home? We should just get married so people can buy them for us." Yeah, honestly, before you guys buy a home, you know, if you guys are a couple, get married first. You know, open up a registry on like in Canada, it's the Bay. <laughs> like let them let people buy all of your housing stuff. Like I didn't I didn't even think about this. Yeah. You know? like, you were a fool. Yeah, we were both a fool. Excuse me. <laughs> you know, we both, you know, have our own place. Well, it's I mean, just... for you, it's for me, it's harder to find someone to marry. Girls in Vancouver don't just find people to marry. No, I'm it's not... It's hard enough to even get a guy to go on a second date with you, so it's <laughs> easier for you. No, I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about, like, in general, like, you know. <laughs> get I married. have to buy my own things. Yes. Well, no, I know that. That's what... Oh. <laughs> what I'm saying is before you move out, you get married, get people to buy your housing stuff first. Cause I'm like, this is so smart. This is so smart because you know, like I think when we get married. Oh, when? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Are you proposing to me You're right now? I'm just gonna cash, cash, cash. Are you gonna, are you proposing to me right now? Maybe, maybe, yeah. yeah. 
No, tell us about that time you went to a bridal shower. Yeah, it was, you know, <clears throat> I mean, this one year at work, there was a lot of, I've been to so many baby showers that year. It was, <laughs> it was just like, I don't know what's, what's, what's going on in the water. Everyone's getting, everyone's getting pregnant. So, but then this <clears throat> wedding shower, you know. What this, did you do at baby showers? We just go out and we have to buy them, you know, like gifts and like we just go out to eat. It's like a gathering. Go out to like a restaurant, you know, and like. Usually, baby showers like at like someone throws a baby shower. Well, my work did for oh. this one, yeah. Oh, okay. But this wedding shower it was just the, the 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 bride was like, hey, you know, you should come. Um, it'll be fun, you know, my my uh, fiance is going to be there, you know, <laughs> so just come. I was like, yeah, sweet. I li you know, I like the fiance. So I'm like, sure, why? I'm like, are you, sh you I said, you're for sure he's going to be there, right? There's going to be some other guy there. And he's like, yeah, you have to come. It's like, you know, it's nearby. So I went there. Guess what? He wasn't there. <laughs> so it was just me. It was me and like. How many women? It was like five or six women really yeah so and, what are you talking about? not only that we play games like <laughs> just i don't know what kind of game where you have to act what is it where you have to act it a out charade. Like, a charade <laughs> but it was like you know like what is your favorite sex move oh my and gosh i have to act those kind of stuff out you know With so, five or six women i i pick one out You're of the hat sport. and it was like show us your favorite sex move and i was like Oh my god. What did you do? So no, no, don't fuck, don't no, talk, don't tell us. By all means, it was, you know, I had fun. We had fun. But <laughs> never again. Jump. Never. It's for, you know, I don't know. It's, I don't know. it's only for women? <laughs> you know what? I'm not even going to say that. I mean, it is like, I don't know. It's not really. If there's a guy there, I'll go. But if not, then, hey, you want some? Is that all there is? No, it's not cooked yet. Look, oh, sorry. Yeah, you're right. oh. Ah! 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 Pork down! <laughs> all right. Are you okay? I'm gonna wash my jeans. Can you just wash them? You can wash it. Yeah. I'll throw it out. What? No. <laughs> throw it out. Throw it out. Throw it out. Why would you throw it out? <laughs> Beef. Thank you. Oh, great. I just put this in the danger plate. <laughs> Disinfect. <laughs> so, uh, <clears throat> Meg and her friends also have a, a podcast. Mm -hmm. Why don't you tell us a bit more about that podcast, Meg? Uh, <laughs> sure. Um, it's called Questionable. We talk about rom-coms and we compare it to our own questionable love lives that's what we do mm. Mm -hmm. so it's me my friend daphne and my friend eric every two weeks we get together but mostly we get together so that eric can cook delicious dinners for daphne and i mm. Mm -hmm. and there's an instagram page for that right there is yeah you can yeah. find us on itunes <gasps> google play and that's it, I think. I don't know. Maybe you can find us more. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Daphne usually does all of the technical things. You're so almost I, out of power. I know. I get to watch uh, a lot of rom com. Yes. Doing this. What's your favorite one? Favorite one was uh, Julia Roberts and uh, mm. Charlize Theron. What? We never did one like that. Is it Charlie? No, not Charlie Theron. No, uh, what's her name? Julia Roberts and who is it? I'm eating in Chicago. Cameron Diaz. Cameron Diaz. I'm so my sorry. best friend's what wedding. Is? Yes, that was my pick. Oh, that was so good. That was your favorite one. Yeah. I'm surprised. Oh, also the one where uh, the guy can travel time. Oh, about I'm, time. About time. That's a cute one. Mm -hmm. That was a really good one.
We just watched Dirty Dancing Havana Nights. Havana Una. What did you think about that one? Did you like that one? A little bit cheesy. A little bit cheesy, I would say. But uh, I like it, yeah. You liked it. I liked it. It was awful. <laughs> you have to tell them ah! the, the part where... Because uh, <laughs> there was no subtitle at one point. Oh, the Spanish parts? Yeah. yeah. And then the guy just said familia. I'm like, I swear he was talking about his family right now. He was, for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. For sure. That wasn't helpful at all, though. Can you tell Eric and Daphne about that? Yep. They all <laughs> laugh at you. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's for me, too? Yeah. What about you? Okay. I want the dumpling. Good. Good. Yeah. Really good. Is it a little thick enough for you? Yeah. Yeah. It's a nice, nice cross between like, it feels a bit healthy. Mm. And also like, carby. We're on a diet. <laughs> if you guys are wondering, do you want dumplings? I want to try one. Hey. <laughs> We're on a diet. If you guys are wondering, <laughs> Ian's gonna have abs this year. Yeah, she wants me to have abs. So. Well, you had abs before. Mm -hmm. Life happens. What though. happened? What happened to make your abs go away? My man comes first. It's all of the rice. I love rice. <laughs> he eats rice in secret. <laughs> what secret? I don't keep it a secret. <laughs> I only eat this much rice. That's it. Yes, when you put it on the plate, it becomes like this. But bowl, you put it on the plate. That is a lot of dry rice for one person. Cooked. Cooked. Oh, I'm getting pretty full. Yeah, me too. Yeah, 
ended? No, what's the Game of Thrones? Oh. Yes. What are we talking about? Game of Thrones. Are you excited to watch it? I am, yes. Why? So I tried in the beginning. I think I watched like two episodes. I felt like my memory was still fresh from when I read the books that I didn't really... I, You know, I have my own imagination of the... You know, based on what I've read. So I didn't really want to change that. But it's been a while now. I mean, I'm still waiting for the rest of the book to come out. And at the same time, like... I think it after like the fourth or fifth season, the the story sort of like is not in line with the books anymore, and sure. I don't, you know, mm -hmm. I don't want that. But uh, apparently, the author sort of um, said that you know, even once the books are done, that it's going to sort of be in line with what the show is going to be. So based on that, then I'm so gonna... now the show dictates the book. Sort, sort of, of not. I, I guess now, yeah. So. I mean, Joe Jonas is engaged to Sophie Turner, who's on Game of Thrones. Mm -hmm. So, what's your point? I'm curious about that. <laughs> okay, I'm full. I can't. Fit. I can't eat any <laughs> anymore after this. Yeah. Yeah. After this whole bowl. <laughs> Show them how much you have. <laughs> Not much. Not much. Are you gonna finish all of it? Yeah. You are? Yeah. That's crazy. You said you're full and you have so much left. No, I'll give you some. Don't. Can you give me some enoki mushroom? You just said you're full. Enoki mushroom is like eating air. Just eat that then. You took so much food. Damn. <laughs> oh. Slapping on. <laughs> Pop out every day. So we've been trying to like lose weight. <laughs> so by having calorie deficit on a daily basis. Pretty sure we're not in calorie deficit today. Can't be. Well, you're not. You ate like five slices of bread today. Okay, maybe you are. What do you mean five pieces of bread? Three. Which Three. rounds up to five. Yeah. <laughs> And they're the end pieces. Round down to like two. Two slices of bread. It's like eating a sandwich. No big deal. Would you pour more beer or is that the first cup? That's the first cup. I'm full. That's probably why you're full. All the beer. Yeah. Oh, that you guys are having dinner, that you guys are having great dinner. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Try not to be as full as us. Yeah. Or me. I'm really full right now. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna push myself. I'm just gonna eat this dumpling. Oh, is there any more dumplings? They're so good, aren't they? You ate all the dumplings. Excuse me. How many dumplings did you eat? I ate three. There was ten in there. Was there? I ate seven? No. Can't be I ate seven. Maybe you ate six. No, you're just making me feel bad. Well, you should be bad. You always eat all the food. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> What? No way. Yeah, you do.
Uh-huh. Okay, right, I'm done. Woo! That was good. Mm-hmm. I'm glad we had hot pot. Mm-hmm. I think next episode's probably gonna be past that. Maybe. Maybe. But you guys should do hot pot. It yeah. saves you money. Do hot pot at your own house. You can be in kind of your own home. Also, there's no shouting Chinese people waving at everything around. Oh, we have dessert. I'm so full. What's dessert? What's for dessert? The durian. We eat it tomorrow. So we bought this. Literally, she's one is taro, one is durian, but we have no idea which one's which. We asked the lady. She's like, yeah, whichever one's purple is the taro. I mean, as you can see, how is that purple? Take a look. Tell me which one is purple. They're exactly the same. It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. Anyways, we can't eat that right now. Right. Okay, guys. Thanks Happy so eating! Thanks so much for watching. Um, you know, tune in next time. Yes, please. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye! Bye.